Well, good morning and welcome to day number 10 of our True North Church 21-day prayer challenge for the month of January. Again, this is day number 10. We're two weeks into this and I hope you're enjoying this as much as I am. Today we're praying for our minds to be renewed. You know, the Bible tells us in Romans chapter 12, verse 2, Do not be conformed to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, His good, pleasing, and perfect will. You know, the way you think often determines the way that you act. The church God has built to bring about change in the world always faces the danger of being corrupted by the widely accepted ways of doing things in the culture around it. We, we have a tendency to want to wanna go along with or to blend in with culture instead of blending in with what the Word says. This letter, this uh, letter written to the Romans by Paul, teaches us about the change that happens in you when you become a Christian and the change God continues to bring about in you. That it's not just a change that happens at one point, that it's a constant change that we're going through. And this constant change happens as you're spending time in God's Word and talking with Him in prayer. During that, He shapes our perspective on what is most valuable, on what our purpose in life is, and the pathway that will take us to peace and joy. Isn't that good news? That the more time you spend in the Word, the more that your mind is renewed, the better our perspective is on what's most valuable, on our purpose in life, and the pathway to peace and joy. It goes along with our verse, Psalms 32, 8, doesn't it? This is how we'll pray today. Father God, we love you and praise you and thank you so much. Oh, we thank you so much for sending Jesus. We thank you so much that you saw fit to send your only begotten Son so that you could rescue us from this world, this corrupt world, this corrupt world of thought, this corrupt world and its desires. Father God, that you saved us from that and to put us in a place where we could have a relationship with you. Father, we ask you to renew our minds so that we will know what you are calling us to do. Help us to do the right thing rather than the accepted or the normal thing. As we read your word, Father God, remind us of who we are, remind us of who you are, and remind us of what your purpose is for us on this earth. Father, we thank you for this and praise you for it. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great day.